Hi everyone, we've come to the end of this week of five things that Jesus said. We've seen that Jesus is, says, I am the bread of life. He says, I am the light of the world. He says, I am the good shepherd. He says, I am the resurrection and the life. And today we see something a little different again. Uh, as Jesus approaches his betrayal and his arrest and his death uh, on the cross, as he approaches that, Jesus begins to talk about the comfort of a secure future. He says to his friends, do not let your hearts be troubled. My father's house has many rooms. Uh, he says that he's going there to prepare a place for them. He says they know the way. And at that point, that provokes Thomas, one of Jesus' dear friends, to say, uh, we don't know where you're going. How can we know the way? And at that point, Jesus says it. He says, I am the way and the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Now that uh, word Father, that reminds us that the God of the Bible is a trinity. We've said about this before, one God, three persons, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And Jesus, the Son, is in such a close relationship with the Father that he can say, uh, you can come to me and come to the Father. Come through me and you'll come to know God, our Heavenly Father. Now this is incredibly ex exclusive, isn't it? Jesus says, no one comes to the Father except through me. And Jesus says, I am the way. Not I am one way or I am a way to the Father, but I am the way. I am the truth. I am the life. That's inc incredibly exclusive and unpopular in our culture to say something like that, isn't it? But at the very same time, this is incredibly inclusive, isn't it? It's simply come to know Jesus and you can come to know the Father. Now, it doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter where you're from. It doesn't matter what background you have or haven't got. It doesn't matter whether you've from a church background or not. It doesn't matter whether you're black or white or anything else. It doesn't matter who you are. If you come to know Jesus, then you can come to know the Father and have life forever with him.